Hey guys, in this video, we're breaking down the 6 best laptops for video editing available right now. We've included options for every type of consumer. If you want more information on the best and most up-to-date pricing on the mention, be sure to check the links in the description below. Okay, so let's get started with the video. The first product on our list is the number 6. MacBook Pro 16 M2 Max 2023. The MacBook Pro 16 with M2 Max is an absolute beast of a laptop. It will tear through any video editing you can throw at it and still be ready for more. Unfortunately, it also comes with a monstrous price that is truly quite hard to recommend spending. What the M2 Max gives you in terms of raw power for content creation is amazing. You can also get great results with a MacBook Pro 16 with Apple's M2 Pro chip, so only users who need the absolute most power for their workflow will use the M2 Max to its full potential. Processor aside, the MacBook Pro 16 is a fantastic laptop, with a lot going for it from the beautiful color accurate screen, booming speakers, sharp webcams, and excellent keyboard and trackpad. It is a very worthy upgrade for anyone using Intel-based MacBooks. At number 5, Razer Blade 15. The Razer Blade 15 is special in that it features an optional OLED display rather than a traditional LCD. With deep, inky blacks and punchy, vibrant colors, it looks incredible, and with its 4K resolution equating to a pixel density of 282 Pi, it's super sharp perfect for editing your UHD content on. With a hugely fast NVIDIA GeForce graphics card under the hood, it's up to the task when it comes to even the most demanding projects, and when you consider how many ports this thing has, 3 USB ports, 2 Thunderbolt slash USB-C, 1 HDMI 2.1 port, and a headphone jack, it's versatile too. If you opt for the base version, you even get an Ethernet port for fast, wired internet, while the advanced model strays this for a useful SD card reader instead. The Razer Blade 15 comes with a 512 GB or 1 TB SSD for storage, and the advanced model can even be optioned with a 2 TB SSD. A lightweight submenace 2.2 kg design and sleek finish set the blade apart externally. At number 4, Acer Predator Helios 300. Best for affordable video editing laptop. When compared to the competition, Acer's Helios range offers gaming capability at a reasonably low cost, particularly considering how much is packed into these laptops. Additionally, it implies that video professionals may take use of its influence without necessarily spending a fortune. It can compete with some of the greatest laptops available, and owing to substantial storage, up to a 1TB SSD or an SSD and hard drive double act, it's the ideal choice for 4K video hoarders. It comes with Intel Core i7 power and up to 32GB RAM in its stop off the line configuration. Like some other gaming laptops, it has a turbo button that you can press to boost performance for prolonged editing sessions. The fan also has fine-grained control, so you can adjust its speed depending on whether you want a cool laptop or a quiet workstation. At number 3, Dell XPS 15, the best Windows video editing laptop with a smart design. The Dell XPS 15 is the 4K old screened laptop to go for if you're not into gaming. While it uses a similarly spec display to the Razer Blade 15, which is also in this roundup, its design and feature set are better suited to video editing. For starters, it has an SD card slot and up to Intel Core i9 power, not to mention up to a huge 64GB RAM, and with up to 2TB solid state storage it's also an ideal machine to have when ingesting gigabytes of 4K content. 
While its NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3050D graphics card isn't going to stack up against some of the top-tier competition, thanks to Thunderbolt 4 connectivity you can supplement it with an external, desktop GPU for more demanding projects, and for quick edits on the fly, it'll be more than up to the task. At number 2, Asus ROG Zephyrus G15. Want a capable laptop for editing videos but don't want to go the MacBook route? If you want a laptop computer with unrelenting computing power, this is it, in our opinion. There won't be anything this beast can't handle with its powerful octa-core AMD Ryzen 7 or Ryzen 9 CPUs and staggering 48 GB of RAM. You also have an option of NVIDIA's super-powerful GeForce RTX 30 series graphics cards, which are specifically designed with gaming in mind. The additional visual acceleration is not only excellent for gaming but also highly useful for GUI-accelerated video encoding. A 15.6-inch WQHD 2560x1440 IPS screen completes the package. Okay, so it's not for K, but it does support Dolby Vision HDR and has 100% coverage of the difficult DSi P3 video color space. It is unfortunate that there is just a microsd memory card slot available, and that the USB ports are USB 3.2 Gen 2 rather than the newest USB 4.0. However, these are really minor gripes with a computer that can edit videos quite well. At number 1. Microsoft Surface Laptop Studio Want a laptop and tablet all in one for video editing? The Surface Laptop Studio could have the solution. The Surface Laptop Studio features a dual hinge, Unlike other hybrid computers of this kind, which convert using a 360-degree hinge, it can be opened in the same way as a typical laptop, but there is an additional hinge around the center of the screen that allows you to slide the screen forward and lock the bottom in place magnetically right above the touchpad. Alternatively, it may rest flat where the lid would typically be. By doing this, you may have a 360-degree hinge in the fat tablet design without having the keyboard protruding comfortably from beneath. The pretty powerful 11th generation Intel H-series CPUs provide editing capability, while large spenders may choose NVIDIA RTX 3050D graphics for hardware video acceleration. By selecting all of the available options, you may have 32 GB RAM and 2 TB of SSD storage. This remarkably adaptable laptop can handle tasks that a MacBook Pro cannot, thanks to its excellent display, sophisticated cooling system, superb pen compatibility, and respectable speed. Just be careful not to overspec this, since the price might rise far more quickly than any possible performance improvement. So that sums up today's video. We hope you enjoyed and if you did please leave a like on the video. And if you're new here hit that subscribe button. Until next video have a great day.